What mitral valve disease is, is an abnormality of the mitral valve, which sits between the left upper chamber and the left lower chamber of the heart. The valves exist in the heart to allow blood to flow through efficiently and prevent blood from moving in the wrong direction. The two types of mitral valve disease are mitral stenosis, a narrowing of the valve, or mitral regurgitation, which is a leakiness of the valve. With mitral stenosis, the blood going from the left upper chamber to the left lower chamber is inhibited. So the left upper chamber has to develop a high pressure to squeeze the blood to that lower chamber. When that high pressure develops, the next earlier location, the lungs, um, pressure develops, uh, high pressure develops in that as well. That gives you shortness of breath. Now with the leakiness of the valve, the mitral regurgitation, blood flows through easily, but when the ventricle, the lower chamber, squeezes, a significant amount of blood comes back into the left atrium, again causing the pressure to go up, and that again can give you shortness of breath. The treatment options for mitral valve disease are different for the different valve disease. Mitral stenosis is uh, primarily treated with a balloon catheter. If the valve is appropriate for this, you can go in with a catheter from the area in the leg all the way up to the heart, place a balloon across the narrowed valve, inflate the balloon, deflate it and remove it, and you've decreased the narrowing going from the upper chamber to the lower chamber. If the valve is not a good valve for the balloon catheter, then surgery is the option, replacing the valve. For the mitral regurgitation, the standard of care is surgery. And ideally, repairing the valve is the best option for the patient. At UPMC, we have all the options to treat mitral valvular disease. We have surgeons that are experienced in repairing and replacing mitral valves. We have echocardiographers who have a wealth of experience in identifying exactly the problem and giving us the best uh, information so that we can treat it precisely. And we have interventional cardiologists that are skilled in the catheter-based approaches to treating the mitral valvular disease. So this team works together with the patient and the patient's family to decide what's the best treatment option for that specific patient. Our goal, as, as the goal of the patient and the family is, is to get you back on your feet, give you the highest quality of life as quickly as possible.